What I don't like about dirt bikes. Today, my trusty assistant, Sassy here, is going to help us uh, say what we don't like about dirt bikes. Give me a kiss. So Sassy here, is basically showing you where the seat is. It's a really easy bike to ride. Um, it goes on the dirt, that's fine and all, but when I wanna go ride to go, I don't know, see my mom, I can't because it's not street legal. So. I just don't like dirt bikes. I mean, it's a good bike and all, but it doesn't suit my lifestyle. Um, it also does not suit my wife's lifestyle anymore. So we basically took it out twice and I'm still paying for it. And it just sits in this garage. Right, Sassy? Okay. It's okay. She's never been in the garage before. It's just a garage. It's like your cage, but bigger than for cars. I mean, you can tell that I haven't really moved it much. There's cobwebs. But yeah, it's been used twice. I've had it for a year exactly. I'm still paying for it. I just, here. Um, it just, it's just not for me. I, I'm a street girl kind of girl. I think that, I think that a dirt bike, you have to be raised with that kind of lifestyle. So if, if I'm a three-year-old Tana, or no, that might be too young, five and a half year old Tana, and my mom's like, here's a dirt bike. And I'm like, cool mom, right on. Can I bring my bird? You know, catching, catching 10, right? I don't know what you'd call it because I'm from the beach, so. I think it's 100 degrees now. That's probably why I'm not really on the dirt bikes. I am hemorrhaging cash on this purchase and I should have just bought a, a sport bike. Like I've been riding, huh? Is he just using me? I just killed a butterfly! Oh. You're distracting me. So what I'm trying to say is if you're interested in buying my dirt bike from me, comment below or send me a private email. My email is in my about me or somewhere on my channel, I'm sure. Um, and just tell me because I'll let you come pick it up and we can do this, uh, this deal because I do not want this bike anymore. You basically know the vehicle history because it's all on YouTube. <laughs> Thing you have seen on YouTube is the only vehicle history it has. So if you're interested, contact me. <laughs> so I'm from Southern California. It's just kind of a hassle to take a dirt bike out. Literally, you have to go in and find where you put all your dirt bike stuff because it's time to finally use it and it's buried with all of my recyclables. So it's all in here. Boots, gear, mud from previous rides, literally. We've got the Grand Canyon here, bottles, barbecue, cans, dirt bike stuff. This is just freaking inconvenient how to get my There's a lot of tracks like Gorman and uh, Roher Flats, Jawbone. I took it out twice, so it just wasn't for me, and that's okay. Um, if you're really into dirt bikes, this is a good dirt bike. There are a lot of dirt bike riders out here, but I, I'm just not one of them, and that's okay. I tried, right? That's what matters. I am 
just so frustrated right now. Like, why? Why? I'm trying to save the planet, guys. One bottle at a time, okay? I'm not a freaking hoarder. So this bike does not have a Kickstarter. It has an electric start. I'm not gonna start it up because my bird's in the garage and I don't want to scare her. This is all, I, all you need to do to turn it on. Just do that. Uh, you gotta turn your fuel on. So you just turn that to on and that's it. And you just push this button right here. So it's an electric start. Make sure you remember to turn it back off and turn that back off. I, I think you get the idea. I'm just gonna put that back. There's nothing aerodynamic about this helmet. It's, it's light, that's a good thing. The only thing I like about this helmet is that it says Ventura County, California on it. Represent! I have nothing against the people that ride dirt bikes. I have the utmost respect for you guys and girls, but it's just not for me. I just think it's too much work. And then when you've, you, you have to set a date, you have to plan around it, make sure you have food, it's basically like camping. So there's tactical boots, right? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and that's cool. I like camping. Just not with my bike. And that's okay too. Sassy's really, really good at shredding paper. She loves to shred paper. That's our grocery list. If I ever want her to shred, I don't know, bills or whatever, I'm like, here you go, here's, here's a bill. Wait, that's my paycheck, give it back. I love my bird so much. Come here, say bye. Say bye to YouTube. Okay, bye. I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you. Sassy is a conure, by the way. Isn't she amazing? She is the most amazing bird. Can you do a pull up? Something else I don't like about dirt bikes, there's no key. So anybody can come and just steal my bike. What? Why? Why would you do that? Don't steal motorcycles, I swear. I've had my bike stolen before. It's not fun. It's a horrible, horrible experience. There's a YouTube video out there somewhere. If you just type in Tana Moody got her bike stolen, whatever. Um, I f***ing cry, okay, no, I don't, S sorry. It was my birthday, and I came back from Disneyland, and my bike was gone. Can you imagine that? Put yourself in my shoes. It's your birthday, you just went to the happiest place on earth, you come back and your motorcycle is gone. And guess what? You only have liability insurance on it. You've been robbed. That could potentially happen with this bike. There's no key. So, uh, bye. There's a bunch of compilations out there of motorcycles being stolen. That's my horror video time. If I feel like being scared, I don't turn on a gory movie. I turn on motorcycles being stolen. That's scary. Uh, follow me on social media. Uh, Instagram is Tana May Moody, and that's it. Cut.